Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Choma Ahanwa. <laughs> From the title, you should already know what we're talking about. I'm back in Canada. It's almost a month now, and I'm just filming this video because I really just wanted to get in my space. I really just wanted to, you know, calm down and get to, like understand or like get back to the vibe of being in Canada because honestly, it's really well, and I'm not like it's a huge it, like it's been what six years. And it's been such a long time and I'm, I don't think I'm even necessarily ready for this life. <laughs> I just wanted to just let you guys know, give you guys a tea on me coming back, on me coming here and whatever. So some people do not know this, but I actually used to live in Canada last few. If you're new to this channel, like you don't know me, you've never seen my channel before, <laughs> welcome to the gang. Please subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the gang. Please click on the subscribe button. You know what it is. Her. I like this video so that other people can get to see this and learn. There's so much I do on my YouTube. I do vlogs. Sorry, I do vlogs. I do mostly vlogs, yeah, but like I do lifestyle. Like it's basically about me. Her. So how has it been? How has it been? I really just wanted to start with how as how how has it been it's been crazy there's a vlog but like i've not posted it because i really just want to do this first and like let you guys know what the tea is because it's been weird i just come back so i came to, i came back here from school i'm actually doing my master's eee, master's degree holder almost ready like i already have written my resume you guys like master's is on the top i'm not gonna lie a few years back i would have said nope I'm not doing this. <laughs> I'm not doing this. Low key, maybe that was the good thing about going back to Nigeria because honestly, when I was here, my mind was set that after undergraduate, I'm done with school. I don't want to do school because honestly, I'm not a school person. I prefer to work than to go to school, honestly. But getting that degree in the bag, come on, it's it's an added advantage and I'm ready for it. Like I'm going to be blabbing a lot in this video, but I really hope you guys are like understanding where i'm going and what i'm talking about i'm so grateful for my best friend for that mm. she has just been my my support system because she was the one that came she came with her sister to pick okay shout out to her sister to love it daddy um she was the one that came to pick me from the airport with her sister it's just been so it's, it's been great having them around it's a huge change first of all there's time difference because i came like a few days to classes starting it just went from boom boom like there was not so much of a there was there wasn't a break in between for me to like maybe calm down and get to know the system and like maybe allow my um time the time difference to get to me it just went boom straight into school i'm still trying to get used to the time difference um the weather ah you guys i came the worst because my friend um aisha she came she came to canada in um september so like she was able to transition gradually into the um the weather situation unlike me yeah i came boom straight into straight like straight from hot very hot to very cold like eyes block cold and you know what's so funny last time i came to canada it was this same scenario i came in in january as well and it just hits me it's always that vibe for me and it's so funny because even when i went back to nigeria i went back in january january has a thing for me mm, the rules are so strict and like so direct like you cannot do work i don't know if you guys know what j working is but like you know how you just in nigeria you see you see that you look your life you look your right you see that no car is coming and then you just cross the road that's j working i realized that it's not necessarily like they were going they're going to do anything to you they're going to arrest you but technically it's not allowed because it's like it's seen as you're trying to commit suicide 
Okay, I know that some people really want to know study permits and whatever. <laughs> I've seen most of these videos and most of them come with a lot of questions. So I'm going to be doing a QA video. So you guys should just put your questions below. You can also message me on Instagram. Um I will put my Instagram handle right here or on Twitter, you know, just message me anywhere and yeah, I'm always ready to talk. Well, I I, I guess it wasn't necessarily easy or going i'm not going to say it was easier for me because i've been in canada before no it wasn't it wasn't that it was just the same scenario so whatever videos you've seen previously from other people talking about it's the same thing there was no difference with oh being being here before and then coming back again like they didn't even care about that i don't think they did this was the same line that i stood when i came in the same line that i posted like it doesn't matter and the same person i'm not gonna lie Oh my god you guys i'm really sorry i say i'm not gonna lie a lot but like i've seen other people that apply and they get it in like months in like they will apply and then they're still waiting for six months and whatever me you when i applied <laughs> oh my god i'm really sorry i like to laugh it up um uh, when i applied i got it two months later i was even so shocked because i was expecting like i was even already i was ready to defer my admission and then so two months that's exactly two months i'm not joking you guys exactly two months from when i submitted my um uh, biometrics that was when I got my visa. That was when I got my visa, um, the email to submit my passport. It was very quick. What do people say in these type of videos, really? Because I really just wanted to tell you guys that I'm in Canada and I am enjoying, um, enjoying the process. I'm alone <laughs> because like my family is not here with me. I've been staying with my family for six years. So it's really, it's a huge change for me going from always with my family, like always we had the same time so like i could call them at any time and they were going to be the other day i called my mom it was around i can't remember the time that i was here but it was 11 a.m 11 p.m her time and i called her and then it clicked to me like after I had, the phone had already rang and i cut it quickly it clicked to me that oh time difference right it's really 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 hard staying without my family because i've done it for i've been doing that for six years and now i'm alone like i have no family member with me i try to call them all the time but i'm also trying to i'm also it's boring i've been trying to look for a job you guys i've been hustling for a job i'm always applying for jobs i'm not gotten back from it nobody has gotten back to me i'm really hustling for jobs because uh, I don't know how to not work anyways you guys i really hope i'm able to create content for you guys here one of the things i stated very clearly in my application for the letter the message that you sent was that i wanted to create canadian content because one thing i never did the previous time i was here was create content in canada so i'm really hoping that i'm able to create content for you guys and it is nice content i mean since i came here i've not created content this is the first time i'm even doing makeup i've really not created content since i came here so i'm really hoping that i'm able to create a lot of content vlogs um clothing hauls maybe just anything anything fun maybe get some friends over to like come and sit here and we can have conversations and like do games or whatever but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you guys like this video you know the vibes you know the uh, you know the vibes but yeah i'm in canada <laughs> and i want my red to represent because ooh, canada's color is red it's red is it red yeah it is it is like red fresh orange don't forget to like subscribe subscribe i mean you watch this video and i know you gained something so why can't i gain too yeah remember don't forget to ask your questions because i'm going to be coming with you guys with a q a after the vlog because the vlog is going to be going on next by the way so like subscribe and leave your comments below and i'll see you guys in my next video all right